And we started off with like three, right? Yeah. We started off with like the Naruto, um, the Free, and the Attack on Titan. Now I've got licenses and like other ones that are actually like, you know, already in the approval process for maybe like 30 plus titles now. Um, so, and they span, you know, like over like Viz, Sentai, uh, Funimation, Crunchyroll titles, um, Anaplex. So we're trying to get everybody. And uh, because it's true, man, like nobody was doing them for anime. It gave us a chance to really just kind of get in, get really aggressive. Uh, and I was just kind of really just open to, you know, what was out there. And so, um, so they're turning out really well, man. And, and we're finding that, you know, certain types of artwork definitely works best. Like the punchline, like the JoJo looks really dope. The Tokyo Ghoul looks really dope. Um, and so, you know, with all the different options that we do got now, you know, it really is just trying to choose like the right artwork for it. But it's the same process and, it, and everything really just kind of moves really quickly. You know, like I had like contracts, you know, just signed for like a bunch of these just a couple months ago. Um, told them like, you know, we're trying to get some shown and sampled out over here for like t for Toy Fair. We we're able to move that fast and get some actual like physical samples and copies out here. So, so yeah, man. So it's uh, for us. Like that's where like uh, a lot of the attention and the effort uh, was going in for like the past year. That's even, that's even better because, like I said, you got all these, these like movie quality posters for yeah. shows, and it's like, I mean, these are could, this could be exclusive. Like, are you going to get it at this spot or that spot, or you just do a mass thing? Yeah. Either way, these are definitely something that any fan would want right now yeah and I think what the real beauty of it is too is that since we do have access to all the different licenses for it and since you know nobody was like in the market for it before it gives us a chance to not only just like concentrate on like you know like the like the huge huge kind of titles we could kind of get a little bit more niche you know what I mean yeah. that that we could kind of service like you know um, like smaller market type shows but really that still have the same kind of passionate fan base and give them like some actual product from it you know so it doesn't need to be um you know just like attack on titan or just naruto or even just just dragon ball z which we are doing and everything um we could you know go for like other titles that you know like i've always been just looking for any kind of merchandise for it. so it kind of gives us that avenue so uh, titles like dorara this came out the second season that's has a big following. Even if it's, even it's a niche show, yep. it's still that whole fans want it. Fans want merch for it. Like, yep. you, like you said last year, fans want merch for it no matter what it is. Keychains, oh, plushes. Totally. Yeah, I got more keychains than I need because that's the only thing that's available sometimes, you know? And so even with like the biggest show like this season, like that's like the number one show on Crunchyroll this season is Erased, right? And that's an Anaplex title. And it's... To me, it's the best show. Like, really, it is. Like, it deserves that title because it's the best show. Like, everything about it is perfect. Like, animation is perfect. Story is deep. It's, like, for a more mature kind of audience and everything. Um, and so, what? I mean, really, it was just an email to my contact over at Anaplex asking them if anybody is, you know, if they have merchandise rights for it, which they confirmed, so that we are interested in making, like, you know, some, some 3D lenticulars or even some silk screen kind of posters. And, you know, so now we're already, you know, on our way to, you know, putting something in writing for it that, uh, that you know, we could probably get out, you know, within the same year that it first, like, kind of simulcasted. And if they produce uh, a, a second season, then we should be able to produce something while that season simulcasts as well. So, I mean, the actual speed of it, um, it it's a, just a real advantage. And plus, it's, you know, it kind of revolutionizes certain things like you know 2d's you know you could always get that you know t-shirt um like you know stickers uh wall scrolls or something like that um so this just kind of falls in line with the same thing where you could get something really fast for something that you just kind of have a new love for that you just discovered that's still like brand new that's still happening and you could have like merchandise to support it so you know nothing's in writing or totally confirmed yet but you know i'm really confident that we'll be able to have some erase stuff like really soon Cool. I mean, so like the posters again. Most I think that's the most exclusive item I've seen. I mean, you can always get statues, all that stuff. I mean, I'm loving your anime um, tracksuits because, like I said, the hair was like the biggest draw that's the for biggest me. Thing, yeah, definitely the biggest thing. Like that was, 
you know, all credit goes to Viz for that, for real. Um, for them to, you know, take a look at, like, how the normal Trexies were produced that had, like, you know, a different, like, rotated head feature. But kind of seeing a little bit beyond that to something that's a little bit better and asking for, you know, if we would consider even, like, the, the idea of producing it that way. And we're like, we're on board with it. And after looking at it, we're like, you know, that's the best, that, 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 was, that was the best decision made for the, for the actual series. And, you know, over the past year, like, you know, like, we've been able to get it, like, through, you know, through through our normal, like, you know, mom and pop kind of channels and everything. That That's, you know, our basis right there. That's number one always. And they did really well at the conventions. Like, you know, a couple of them sold out, like, over at, like, Comic-Con and, and, uh, and uh, Anime Expo and everything. Um, and so, you know, now you can get them, like, uh, Barnes & Noble's carried, like, the Naruto Trexies over, over the holiday. There's, you know, we're still getting reorders from them. Um, Hot Topic got them. Uh, Spencer's got them. Like all the different chains and everything um, that, you know, with, that's within our actual licensing contract that I could try to get to. Like we've been able to get it there, you know. And so for me, like, you know, being able to go to like the mall and um, going to a local Barnes & Noble, like my local Barnes & Noble, and walking in there and just seeing like product that I've, you know, helped get there. Like, I'm like, that's dope. Like, that's real fulfilling, man. And that's what, you know, creates, like, a real drive to keep on going. It's, a, again, doing amazing work always. And I'm sure you would love to get your hands, like, say, like you got the Ninja Turtles license for the minifigures, for the armored ones. I'm sure you'd love to get your hands on for the rights for the posters for that, to the new series on Nickelodeon. That's a, that's a, I actually haven't even thought about that, man, but it's a, do, that's a definitely um, good suggestion, man. Like, I think, I, I know, like, last year when I talked to them, they, they did say they had, like, 3Ds for, for their other titles. Yeah. I don't, but, I guess, yeah, man, they should be on the table, huh? Yeah, definitely. Oh, let's go number, like, movie number two, like, for real. Like, I can see it. Like, I can definitely see it. And I'm sure, like, you know, the artwork and the, and the assets that be available, I mean, I think that would be pretty amazing. So, yeah, man, I'm going to have to credit you for that one. <laughs> awesome. Well, if you go on Ninja Turtles, definitely look into Power Rangers. So they come out their new season already, and they're always coming out with the newest one, especially for the American version. Japanese Center is already on to the next one already. So, again, the possibilities with these are endless. You you just you showed me Naruto and Attack on Titan, and already I was sold. Yeah. Now you're coming back with more, like, Psycho Pass. I love that anime. That's a very popular amongst my friends. Tokyo Ghoul is very big in America. And that's the thing when it comes to anime it is give us something and if it turns out to be big, it turns out to be big. And But you already said, you know what, I, whatever it, the anime is, I can make it happen. I can make it work. Yeah. And it's, you know, and if it's a quality title, like, you know, um, like I watch a lot still. And, you know, it's, it's the stuff that I watch that I enjoy. That's what I'll pursue, you know, for real. Um, or, you know, but I'm always, but I can't watch everything. So I am open to like, you know, when people tell me if, if, if there's something that, that's just not on my actual like menu or my list, like, you know, I'll look into it, you know. Um, but that's why like it's easy to, to really pick out the right type of artwork, especially from the shows that I watch, because I'll know which ones like I, I'd appreciate myself. So it really just comes from that standpoint of, um, you know, what do, what, what do I want to see in the market? And, and if it's not out there yet, like, there's got to be a way for me to make it myself or, you know, or just pursue it um, so that, you know, just Yes Anime could just, you know, uh, just get into that business of, of promoting merchandise for that actual property because it deserves it, you know? Again, awesome work as always. Thank you for your time again as sure, always. Man. Yes, sir, man. I'll see yeah. you. I'll see you.